Lewis County, where the FBI is involved after the driver of an armored of an armored car carrying cash was robbed at gunpoint. This happened right before noon today at the Overland Save a Lot. Right now, the suspects are still on the run driving that vehicle you see there on the right side of your screen. That's a black Jeep Grand Cherokee. News Force Gabriel Vidal is hearing from a former Save a Lot worker who says theft and safety have been a problem at this Overland store. I'm just happy that everything, everyone was okay and no one got hurt. A startling sight for Save a Lot shoppers. Pues es la primera vez que... Maria de Los Angeles Moreno Montiel telling News 4 this is the first time she's ever seen something like this. Police cars and tape tell of the crime scene here, where the Loomis security truck driver was held up. Thankfully, I wasn't here earlier, she says. Former Save-A-Lot employee Ari Schifferdecker came to check on a friend who was working when two armed robbers struck. He called me and said that the Loomis guy got robbed and he said that he saw a car pull up right behind the Loomis guy and the guy jumped out and they had guns. Overland police believe suspects in this Jeep Grand Cherokee followed the Loomis truck to the store. Two people in black ski masks and gloves got out of the Jeep and disarmed the Loomis driver when his back was turned. The suspects took the driver's gun, held him at gunpoint and took his bag of cash. One thief tripped and dropped a long gun before getting back in the Jeep, which had a getaway driver. They headed south on Woodson Road. While workers and shoppers are relieved no one was hurt in this robbery incident, this isn't the first time that workers have raised concerns about their safety in the past. A lady just came up here with a knife the other day and got arrested and a guy had come with a hatchet before, got caught stealing and so theft happens a lot here, but I never thought anything like this would happen. Overland police tell News 4 they've been to the store before, but didn't have specific information on previous incidents available. This is the busiest save a lot around, so I don't know what can be done. Save a lot says they're working with authorities. Loomis has not returned News 4's request for comment, and the FBI is also involved in the investigation. In Overland, Gabrielle Vidal, News 4. There's been a series of armored vehicle robberies taking place in other parts of the country, including several reported in Chicago. The FBI tells News 4 in these types of investigations, they always look at whether this could be connected to other similar attempts.